show A Closer Walk with Patsy Cline, I'm going to play The Men, which is a uh, little big man and on the air DJ who tells the life story of Patsy Cline. And then once Patsy goes to the Grand Ole Opry, I get to play the Grand Ole Opry comic. And once she goes to Las Vegas, I get to play the Las Vegas comedian. Patsy Cline died in 1963, and since then, actually since her death, she sold more records after her death than she did when she was alive. What's brilliant about that is that it says so much about the music. It says so much about um, how she impacted not just country music, because she hit the popular charts back in the 60s and the 50s as well. In fact, she was one of the, f she was, I think, the first uh, female country artist to break into the pop charts. Uh, no other artist had done it uh, before that, and it was very few after that until people like Shania Twain. I did go see me a doctor this morning now. Had to have me one of them there physical checkovers, don't you know? Doctor said, Melvin, I got some bad news. You could go any minute. I said, Doc, that ain't bad news. I ain't gone in three days. Um, one of the joys of me doing this show is that I play the narrator and basically I will introduce Patsy or a song and then I get to sit on stage and watch and listen to Patsy sing the songs and it's fantastic music and it's stunning music and the show itself I think is a wonderful heartwarming uplifting and in the end tragic story of, of the life of Patsy Klein so I think it really does appeal there is a crossover the music is so good it's so catchy it's so touching it crosses over from pop to country and then the story, um, I think you can't help but be affected by it. From October 30th to November 11th, we are going to be playing at the Intimate McManus Theater within the Beautiful Grand Theater.